Okay, middle school. This time you guys get to make your own um, roll the dice draw game. So I have included this in your um, doc. If you want to print this out and use this, you can. If you don't have a way to print, I'm going to show you how to do it without printing. But this is your example that you're going to go off of. So if you don't have a way to print, you're going to get out a piece of paper that looks like mine. So just a normal piece of white um, paper. What I did was I took my ruler and I made lines. One, two, three, four, five, six lines. So there's five boxes. There's six lines, five boxes. So I'm going to label them over here for my dice. So if you roll a one, if you roll a... If you roll a three, if you roll a four, five, and last six. Okay, so there is um, that side. This side we're going to put first roll, second roll, third roll, fourth roll. Okay, and mine actually has a fifth roll. I know the one that um, is on for you to print off if you would like only has four rolls. It doesn't matter. As long as you have one through six right here you can have as many as you want going this way all it does it doesn't really matter if you have four five six seven um the more you have the harder it's going to be for your for the person who's drawing but it may be funner the more you have so i'm going to show you a game that's already filled out so here is roll a fish game. So the very first part, they have them draw their body, their face, their tail, then their fin, and then they add the extra gills and stuff like that. So all of this row right here is all the body. So if you want to draw a monster, if you want to draw people, I've had landscapes, I've had birds, you know, whatever you want to draw, whatever you have, whatever you want other people to learn how to draw, this is where you're going to do it. So I want to do, um, let's do monsters because monsters are fun. So the very first one is I'm going to do body and I think it helps to label. So body, um, head, feet. Face and I'm gonna say feet and hands. Actually, I lied. Let's just go with feet here and hands. Here. And I'm gonna switch that. I'm gonna do head, face okay so here's my monster so all this row is gonna have to be a body so uh, I think a nice good triangle for a body might be nice um, maybe like a weird oblong shape um, Okay, so there is all my bodies. 
Now I'm gonna do um, my head. So if they roll a one, it's gonna be a circle. If they roll a two, I think it should be an upside down triangle. If they roll a three, um, maybe it should be Maybe it's just all eyes. And then... That one should be square. This one... Maybe that's kind of like an E. There's our heads. Now I'm going to do our face. So this is what's going to go on the inside of your head. So Okay, and then you're going to do all your faces. You can be as creative as you want. Now you're going to do the feet. So maybe this one uh, is going to be a wheel. Maybe this one has some like weird octopus things. Uh, This one's gonna have like three feet, I think. Yeah. Then, um, maybe I do some like, you got some pointy legs. Uh, maybe some. Kind of like a genie. Kind of like just shows up. Alright, so then you can do like your hands, you can say like I want some hands like that. Maybe you want some hands like that. They kind of look like ears, but that's okay. So you're going to fill all of that in. Then you're going to play the game so, if I roll, my very first roll would be number two. So that means I would draw this body on a piece of paper. So you get another piece of paper out, and you're going to draw that body. Four. So that means I have a square head. I can erase where they overlap. Next. Two face, so that's his face I gotta put in there. Okay. Next three. So he has these like square legs down here. yet so maybe his hands would be so he's gonna have weird wiggly hands the little nails coming off okay when you get it all done I want you to color you can use colored pencils markers crayons whatever that you have Okay, get somebody to do this with you. It's really fun to see what comes out. You know, compare drawings. Hope you have a family fun time trying it all. It's really fun just to be creative, to come up with your own 
game. So that is your project for um, this week if you decide to do make your own game project. Hope you have fun. Email me if you have questions.